the oiler. Wunderbar. The gun parts are ready for you on the table. Okay, time to grease these parts. Now to assemble them. gun. Excellent. Just like new. All right. I'm heading to the backyard. Be careful out there, Anna. Why is this cigarette case so unusually bulky? It looks like there's a secret section at the top. I wonder if there's something hidden inside. I'd better go back to the hotel to open it, or I'll end up like this assailant. Thank goodness you are safe. Did you find anything out there? Yes, an unusual cigarette case. I bet there's something hidden inside. Let's see if my suspicions are correct. some instructions just as I thought hmm it appears to be a set of instructions the grammar suggests that the writer isn't fluent in English use code to communicate with prof if he resist kill him and oh let me see that Kill him and all witnesses? By protecting me, you're both in mortal danger. I shouldn't have come here. Calm down, Professor. We've got to stick together. I know, but... Anna, you had a plan, right? Could you tell more details? Yes. Here's what I have in mind. As we know, the assassin won't stop until his mission is complete. It's only a matter of time before he makes his move. My plan is to set up a lifelike mannequin. 
dress it up like the professor and wait for the assailant to shoot his target. The real professor will be hiding in a safe location while this is going on. When it's over, the Nazis will call off their search. The professor should be free to cross the border in disguise. Yeah, this might just work. If the assailant doesn't take the bait, we'll capture him and figure out a new plan. What do you think, Professor? It's risky, but I'm sure we can pull it off. I'm out of options at this point. I'm game if you are. Let's put Maybe a shop in town has fun. Good idea, Otto. I'm heading off to the town. Please be. to the car. Where should I go to find a mannequin? Antique shops carry a lot of odds and ends. I'll start there. Sir. Oh, it's good to see you again. Anna, what a surprise to see you. I'm just here to... Uh, I'm on duty. The shopkeeper's away, so I'm keeping an eye on things here. Of course. Quite a snowstorm last night. I know. I'm here so often, I may take up skiing. What brings you back to town this time? All good, I hope. I'm afraid not, officer. There's been another incident at the Riga Hotel. You see, it all started three days ago. That's horrible. Just horrible. I'll do everything I can to help. Is there anything you still need to pull off your plan? Yes. I'm looking for a mannequin. Do you know where I can find one in town? Hmm. How about this one? Yes. I think that'll work. The height is perfect. It's heavier than it looks. I'll help you carry it. Does the mannequin have a head and hands? I suppose we could put a cantaloupe on it, but... Yes, I believe it does have a head and hands. Have a look around. Miss? Nice to meet you. 
earlier than usual. We're on police business, Jürgen. Do you remember those mannequin hands yesterday? The ones that the magician used for the show? Yes, exactly. Where are they now? Probably in that mess in the corner. Haven't cleaned it yet. If the hands are there, I'll find them. Excellent. I was worried the magician might have run off with them. Thank you, Jürgen. See you in a few hours. I <laughs> feel we'll be waiting for you. Let's go. Let's go. I have everything I need, so I'm going to hurry back to the hotel. Give me a moment to bring my car around. No need, officer. We should use my car. The assailant might not attack if he sees a police car. Good thinking, Anna. You drive. Perfectly fine, Otto. We got the mannequin. Officer, thank you for coming. Danke. We are in a terrible situation here. Yes, Anna briefed me on all the details. I'll help in any way I can, Mr. Rega. Everything went okay in town? The town is quiet, as usual. That is good to hear. So you do not suspect you were followed? No, I think we're in the clear. We took my car instead of a police car to remain covert. Smart thinking. Where should we place the dummy? We'll set up in the hall since the windows are nice and big. Sounds good. Let's get to work. Officer, please place the mannequin in front of that chair, near the... Very good. Now let's assemble it. A trained killer will be able to tell. Hold that thought, Professor. We're not finished yet. Can you give me a few clothing items? Like what exactly? Your coat? A hat? Those sorts of things. I left my coat by the fireplace. Give me a moment. My legs still hurt. Stay there. I'll get your coat for you. Great! I found a coat. There we go. That looks a little better. What else do you need? Can you spare a fedora? I lost one in the mountains, but I may have one more in my room. I'll go check.
The plan has failed. I'm going in. Please, you're under arrest! Drop the gun and put your hands behind your head! I heard the commotion. Is it over? No! Get back to your room! I told you we would find you when... tell you, Yama is protecting me. A little to the left and I would have been dead. Oh, thank God. You scared us half to death, Professor. I will help you get to your feet. Did you get the assailant, officer? No, he was too fast for me. I lost him in the snowstorm. I couldn't track him in this weather. 
then it's over. I'll still be hunted down. Not necessarily. He shot you and saw you drop to the floor. He might think you're dead and tell his commander the mission was a success. That should buy you enough time to leave the country. Hopefully, he'll leave us all out of his report. If I were an elite assassin, I wouldn't tell my superiors I was almost thwarted by the locals. I hope you're right. These bastards must be brought to justice! Do we have evidence of Nazi involvement in all this? You can take the encrypted messages on the table. I also found an insignia on the other assailant. According to the patch, he was from the crew of the Koenig Albert. Beware of anyone wearing that insignia. Duly noted. I'll find out more about the ship through the police channels. Sorry I caused you so much trouble, Otto. On top of everything, now you need new windows. Don't put the blame on yourself, Professor. This is not your doing. We are all alive and well, and that's what matters. Exactly. And let's hope it all works out well, and the threat is no more.